Mulan was, it was so beautiful to watch. Just everything, the graphics, the, you know, styling. So Ife, I would love to know first off, what did it feel like first for you when you stepped onto the set and you were in your costume? Um, yeah, I remember that's the matchmaker scene. And um, I remember when they call for lunch break and they're shooting um, other sites, opposite sites. Um, I, I always tend to stay in my movie home because the set was just so incredibly beautiful. And it just gives me this um, feeling that will help me get into the character, I feel. Every details I see just makes me feel that I really live in that time, in that house. Mm, and Nikki, I'd love to know too, what did you first think when you saw her, you know, stepping out of the set as, you know, as your- Oh, it's, it was such a long time coming because we prepped this movie for so long. It's so much, people don't understand how much work goes in before even, before you start rolling cameras. So the day, when that day comes, it's like everything pulls into focus and there she is and, and it, it was, was a wonderful moment. And it's so fitting actually that you said the matchmaker scene was first because um, I think seeing Mulan now as an adult, it resonated a little bit differently with me. As a child, I'm like, oh, she's awesome, she's a warrior. But now I see how it weighed so much heavily on family values and how marriage is weighed so much, um, especially as a woman, even now across different cultures. Um, it almost seems like marriage is like the marker of success. Mm -hmm. Um, and I would love to know what you hope Mulan, what kind of message it sends to the older viewers, older female viewers. I think, I think, and, and, and maybe this is true in your particular case, it, it feels to me like this version of Mulan is a coming of age. For all the people that loved the animation as children, we now give you guys and, and everybody this new version um, that's a little bit more complex. Mm -hmm. It's certainly bigger and more explosive in its action, but I hope that it still has the heart and the humor from the animation and and that along with its, you know, kick-ass mm. um, action sequences, it has real emotion. Yeah. Yeah, and you face them for you. Do you have... For me, it's, um, you know, you can create your own reality, and therefore you to choose who you want to become. There is no limit. Yes, I love that. And, um, you know, there's so many also different themes throughout the entire film. Which ones resonated with both of you most? There's two for me, and I think probably for both of us, right? I mean, devotion to family, which is like the, the strongest Thing, right for Chinese people I think filial piety um, but also so strong for me because I have a family and I am devoted to them um, but equally the idea of truth of being yourself and that when you are your authentic self when you are not in disguise that's when you can tap into y y all of your power and when you do you can be like Mulan, unstoppable and all-powerful. Devotion to family, right? Yeah. That's it. Yeah, yeah. I, I remember it was on the sword. Mm -hmm. I think really movies did dig deeper on that level, like what is actually devotion to family? It's not one thing, I think. It's actually unconditional love. Unconditional love means you individually you can be you, but the love is just so big, and um, yeah, it's everything. 